going on outside with meteorologist Stevie Daniels. Good morning, Megan. Good morning, Marilyn. So we're waking up to a dry start this morning and temperatures are very similar to how they started out yesterday, about this time 24 hours ago. You can see 60 is a pretty popular number on our temperature map up in Manchester, Ellicott City, even down towards Severn sitting at 60 degrees, a little bit milder for folks down in Annapolis sitting at 66. But of course, the cool spot this morning up in Frostburg and even out by Deep Creek hanging on to the mid 50s and Frederick also sitting at 57 degrees. So good morning to all of you. As we take a look at satellite radar, we're no noticed that uh, we're dealing with that ridge of high pressure still kind of drifting through portions of the Delmarva Peninsula. That's keeping us dry out there this morning, and we're looking to stay dry throughout the rest of this morning with lots of sunshine to kick off your Wednesday. However, as we head into the later parts of the afternoon, we could see a few high thin clouds stream in from the west, and then a pop up shower storm can't be completely ruled out given the fact that we have more heat and even more humidity. So that could allow the atmosphere to be a little bit more unstable. So I wouldn't rule out a pop up up shower or storm right around the Baltimore Metro or areas farther south uh, around six, seven o'clock this evening, but it's going to be very isolated and not every neighborhood will be seeing any rain or much rain for that matter. And then we're looking to dry things out by midnight and then off to a dry start for your Thursday and our temperatures will be on the climb throughout the rest of the work week. You can see your planner today is looking bright and beautiful, especially this morning. Temperatures are going to be right around 82 degrees around your lunch hour. Keep in mind and keep an eye to the sky as that chance of a thunder shower isn't completely ruled out later on this evening. Uh, but looking at your muggy meter, we're kind of close to that uh, sticky category. Those dew point values are actually going to approach the upper 50s and the lower 60s today. So you'll notice that slight uptick in humidity. The same case goes for Thursday, but it's really going to be more noticeable as we head into to the upcoming weekend. It's going to be a very hot and steamy end to the work week and a very hot and steamy start to the 4th of July weekend. So we're tracking the tropics and we have three separate disturbances. One has a 40% chance of developing over the next two to five days across the northwestern Gulf of Mexico. Uh, we have this other one that has a low chance of forming over the next five days, but this one uh, that's currently traveling over the southern portion of the Caribbean Sea today and even through Friday has a very high chance of forming. It's becoming a little bit more organized as it's traveling westward, uh, but no impacts from that system for us here across Maryland. Your 70 forecast shows very warm and humid conditions for Thursday and Friday, topping out in the mid 90s Friday afternoon, feeling more like the mid to upper 90s. And then the chance for showers and storms possible as we kick off the 4th of July weekend. That chance lingers into Sunday and Monday. Liz? Stevie, there are big.